Praise the Lord, everybody. This is Brother Paxton. We are on day three of our Battlefield Prayer Tour 2012 in Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. It's a beautiful day today. I'm at the Alabama Monument I'm at the early part of the battlefield. I want to read to you Matthew chapter 5, verse 6. The Bible says this, Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. First Lieutenant Albert Goodlow of the 35th Alabama was a believer who had a burden to distribute God's word. Listen to what he wrote in his diary. He said, while we were here at Morton, we received a good supply of Bibles, testaments, hymn books, and tracts. We had ordered them before. We had a great need for these, and it was felt keenly in order to carry out our religious undertakings. We got them and distributed them to a multitude of new converts to the religion of our Lord Jesus Christ, and many more who were earnest seekers of the truth. We were, there were many of us who were never without our pocket Bibles as we went along, and there were many others, though, who had lost theirs or worn them out, so we replaced them. And especially we had an urgent need and a desperate supply for hymn books. What a mighty chorus of voices was raised in songs and praises to our God by the soldiers when the hymn books were handed out to our congregation. Ladies and gentlemen, soldiers in the Civil War were more eager for Bibles than at any other time in our history as a nation. Goodlow said that many of the soldiers had worn out their Bibles and needed new ones. It is no surprise that revivals broke out in the camps of the northern and southern soldiers. When there is a hunger, ladies and gentlemen, for the righteousness and the word of God, the Lord promises to fill that hunger, to supply that need. You know, one of, the, one of our most prolific outreaches in our ministry, and it has been this way for years, since the early 90s, is the distribution of Bibles. So many of our financial partners and our monthly supporters help us to literally give away thousands and thousands of Bibles and Testaments and Christian literature throughout the world. How grateful I am that God has brought those people into our lives and ministry. Thank you, partners. Thank you for all that you do, for what you give. Ladies and gentlemen, the hunger for God's Word is what you need to have returned to your life as we go forward more and more into these last days. The Word of God will be our strength the Word of God will be our sustenance. The Word of God will be our hope. The Word of God will be our anchor. The Word of God will be our instruction. Confusing days are coming upon us in so many ways. And you know, things can begin to happen in life so fast that you can get confused easily unless you're firmly anchored in the Word of God. So from Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, this is Brother Paxton saying, we'll see you a little further on up the road. God bless you.